terrifying moments as a shooting breaks out following a high school homecoming celebration in the small town of Marks, Mississippi. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Greg Hurst. Hi, I'm Stephanie Skurlock. Tonight, the city's police chief says at least five people were shot and others were hurt following a stampede. WRG's Shay Arthur spoke with the chief and mayor whose own daughter was one of the victims. This is the first time ever in Quitman County that we have this type of uh, action and we are, we're not used to it. Mark's police chief Marvin Furr has been in his role 17 years. Tonight he's left stunned, frustrated by the violence in the small town with a population around 2000, telling me at least five people were shot in the area of First Street and MLK early Saturday morning. Others injured after being trampled in the chaos. A large crowd had gathered after the homecoming football game. Witnesses tell us once the crowd heard those gunshots, there was a panic effect that rippled throughout the crowd, sending dozens of people running for safety. Chief Fur in the area at the time. At that time, we heard the gunshots, and they was coming in two different directions. And that's when we started getting the calls about people were shot. One of the victims, the mayor's 33-year-old daughter, shot in the arm. A strange feeling. I didn't, didn't know what to do. His niece also shot. But thankfully, they're going to be okay. I'm just thankful that no one got killed. Investigators say it's unclear what led to that shooting, but believe it does not involve people from Quitman County, saying it stemmed from a fight between people from two surrounding towns. Right now, one person is in custody, but the chief says detectives need the public's help tracking down others who caused the violence. The police department is as strong as the community allows us to be, and that's what people have got to realize. We can't do our job properly if we're not getting the information out here that some of the public know. And, and until they speak out, uh, we are handcuffed. In Marks, Shea Arthur, WREG News Channel 3. Yes, they need some help with this one. And they're asking the public to call the Quitman County Sheriff's Office at 662-326-3131 if you have any information on the shooting.